Hi, my name is Dewey Thompson, and I'm the creative director at Pickerel Pie. Production value is what we're talking about when we say that a video looks like a million dollars. We mean that any number of cinematic qualities are present and delighting us. The setting is stunning, the shot is elegantly composed, sometimes with movement that reveals information as it tracks or pans. It's beautifully lit, and the sound recording is clear, and the sound design creates a sense of place. Stop it! It has nothing to do with the script or the talent or performance. Production value is the frame around the performance. It's the value that production, in this case what are known as the crafts, production design, cinematography, lighting, and sound, bring to selling the shot. It's the feeling conveyed to the viewer that the images they are seeing have been very carefully, thoughtfully, even artfully crafted. And when a shot lacks production value, the setting is drab, the lighting's insufficient or poorly aimed, the sound has been badly recorded or mixed, the lack of quality and craft can be distracting. It makes you wonder how skilled and intelligent the messenger is, and moreover, how much whoever is communicating to you really cares about the message. If you're a company using video to communicate, you probably care a great deal about how your company's brand and culture are reflected in the production values of the video. But production values can also be a trap. The careful, elegant, artful qualities I was just describing also mean, of course, that this narrative took time and extensive planning, which suggests that the message is probably not very urgent or spontaneous. The well-crafted video risks seeming, scary music please, inauthentic. If what you're saying to your viewers is urgent or breaking news or spontaneous, you should really think about how too much production value could actually undermine your communication. Capturing a video on a webcam in the office or on a cell phone from home, filming in the back of a cab or walking down the street may do a better job of conveying that urgency and spontaneity. In fact, the lack of production values may be a plus. The one production value that you really can't afford to screw around with, and ironically is the most overlooked, is sound. I'm not sure about the psychology behind it, but bad sound is the canary in the coal mine of production failure. Because no matter how gorgeous the imagery or how excitingly spontaneous the scene, if it sounds terrible, it's gonna be very, very hard to watch. So no matter how or where you shoot, make sure you've got high quality sound covered. Production values describe a bunch of different things that affect the perception of the investment that has been made in an image. But you don't always want or need a fancy frame to tell your story. Thanks for watching. In our next video, we're gonna talk about setting.